Hello, Dr. Youngs. How are you feeling today? Oh, to tell the truth, Greta, I feel awful. The Phi Alpha Theta Conference is coming up, and I have to be in California at the same time for a granddaughter's wedding. I wish I could be in two places at the same time. Don't feel so badly, Dr. Youngs. I have some good news for you. You have won a Lifetime Achievement Award from the History Club and Phi Alpha Theta. Wow. Thank you, Greta. That sounds very impressive. I guess I better start doing stuff to earn it. No, you don't understand. You've already done stuff. You've already earned it. You've already achieved. Well, maybe. But the truth is that any energy I bring to my work is only a reflection of the energy my students and colleagues bring to their work. It's a mutual thing. Maybe they should be getting this award. I hear you, but we want you to have it. Well, okay, but only on one condition. What's that? I get to give my own acceptance speech and I get to make it short and personal. Why not? Well, okay, here goes. I just happen to have a speech that I think will probably work. I accept this award with appreciation for you and all the under, other wonderful students at Eastern Washington University. With gratitude for Professor Lenti and others at Eastern who have worked so hard to make this PA conference possible. And last but not least, with admiration for all of the faculty and students from across the Northwest who have come here for this collective celebration of our craft as historians. Thank you, thank you, thank you.